It's about to go live. Live, 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 live. Live, 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 live. I don't even know anymore. Let's see what happens. Let me mute this. It's about to go. It's about there to go, go live. All right. Okay, muted. I'm not even going to pop out the chat just in case. <laughs> it looks like it should work. I'm not getting the. Oh my God, it's working. Hello, 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 Abdul. How are you? No, I'll pop out chat. <laughs> every, every time I popped it out, got it all ready, and nobody was here. Oh my gosh. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Robert. Hi, Glormar. Hi, Deb. Knocks out Nicole. Deb. Not Lady God. Liberty, Jonathan, Kathy Gibbs. Hey. Hello, hello, welcome. Oh my God, it worked for the first time. I need to get up I and walk away, it. Wendy. That's a trick. I know. When I just give up, and then it comes on. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Curtis. Hi, Wyatt. Graw. Graw. Oh. Hey, Graw. <laughs> She's doing much better. Thank you so much for asking, Graw. I missed you guys, too. I really, really did. I just couldn't do it. I literally was up all night Sunday night because I was so worried about my daughter's surgery in the morning. And then, so I didn't get to sleep. Then we got there, and I didn't get out of there until I think it was like 5. I had to jump on to work because I was supposed to actually only have taken half the day and worked the rest and made it up, but that didn't work. So I was literally on work out working until nine wow trying to make up time and i still had time i had to make up the next day too so it's just and my underwriter was on vacation which was a, the worst time for us to have the surgery was you know that week because i knew that she already was on vacation and i'm her back out back up so it was really just messed everything up and i i still have not caught up on my sleep hey family first you gotta do what you gotta do I know, I know. Yeah, hi, Ronald. Hi, Frank and Miser. Oscar, how you doing? Angela, your sister's here. Hey, Angela. Hey, I'm on top <laughs> chat. Uh. I miss you too. Um, Advocate for Liberty, hello, hello. Hi, Kevin, aloha. Um, Kenzie, how are you? Strider, hello, hello. Cherokee, Big Daddy Addy. Richard Sainer, hey, how are you doing? Uh, thank you so much. Welcome, welcome. Um, let me see. Do, 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 do. An advocate for liberty, liberty. Bob, how are you doing? Richard, Mary Cushions, how you doing, honey? Hey, Richard. Dakota, Richard Willis, Al Ben, Amber, how you doing, sweetie? Al Ben. I think Amber I got Kim. everybody. I think I got. I think I got. Yes, yes, there. So I'm just gonna be using my smallest vape tonight because <laughs> you know I mean Addie's always using his, so I just figured that. <laughs> <laughs> you know i don't want to overdo it you know so i just figured let's just use the smallest one tonight we'll do the biggest one next week <laughs> i knew someone would end up making an addy out of a coke can <laughs> <laughs> exactly hi robin's boy hi robin hi karen slushy how you robin. doing slushy All the, peeps are out. all the peeps are out, Wendy. They all missed you last week. I know. I'm so sorry. I tried to post so that everybody would know, but it's like uh, trying to remember to do everything while I was, you know, at the hospital and, uh, and with no running on no sleep. I know. Hi, Terry Vapor. Hello from Shibuya. Hey, Deb. <laughs> hey, Robin. Hey, Liberty. Hello, Bunny. I'm not yeah. talking to you, Siri. Okay. Hey, Siri, bite me. <laughs> <laughs> Wendy saw the review of the soup can tank. <laughs> Lady Dark Sky, how are you doing? Of course I'm on. I'm here. Uh, let's see. Addie's Twinkie still chuckles. <laughs> <laughs> How'd that Twinkie turn out? Oh, I like it. I don't know about you guys, but if you guys like waffles and you like strawberry and you like ice cream, you have to try my drip witch strawberry clone. I got to try up. it. I'm telling you, I've made a big one because I've been testing it and this is it. I know, right, Deb? <laughs> it still smells so heavenly. Ah! 
Hey, lady. So, so good. Lady Dark Sky. Yeah. I know, Robin. And she constantly pops up on my live streams like she's supposed to be here or something. That's awesome. Happy, Katie. that's awesome. Congratulations, sweetheart. You're doing it. So, yeah. So, I've literally been biting all my cuticles for my nerves. Are really bad. My nails look like crap. I was supposed to get my nails done Saturday, but I was so tired I slept in. Congratulations, Kathy Gibbs. Ten weeks cigarette free and yep. going strong. All right. I just, I, just, yes. um, I just did my nails yesterday, Wendy. Oh, you did? <laughs> and they look really Me good. Me too, Addy. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Maybe yours and Toonies. That's what Robin said. I mean, um, Wendy said. I'm oh, missing awesome. everybody's names. Yeah, the Twinkie. Uh, glad to see you too, Lady Dark Sky. You've been mixing his and not mine, Deb? Really? Fine. Uh -huh. Go ahead and do uh -huh. his. Uh -huh. <laughs> neener, neener. Uh, thank you, lady. I wish. Oh my God. I, I have to get them done. And I can't get them done until Saturday because, and then I got to show up like three hours early before they open. So you know that, get that, my nails done. That mm -hmm. blueberry cornbread pudding that um, we've been playing around with for weeks and it's kind of gotten more back and forth, back and forth. Yeah. Man, I love that stuff. Which one? The back and forth? With the, or the with a VTA custard in it and... Um, and the two different blueberries, you know the. Is that the one we made? Yeah. Oh, okay. Man, that's a good recipe. Wow. Hi, Frank. Welcome, welcome. Frank. I'm okay. like, if I'm out of it a little bit, I'm just so tired. So please forgive me. I should be waking up soon. <laughs> yeah, I got two gallons. How much did I get? I got two gallons and another. Another one of these size. Um, but yeah, I'm still waiting for the one. As a matter of fact, my gallon, my second gallon is supposed to be here today. Oh, no, I think it's coming Wednesday. I'm thinking I want to pick up one of those 250 milligram per mil jugs. I don't know. I got the 100 milligram, but I got two gallons. I'm just so, so used to the Carolina extract that I don't know if I could go back. <laughs> Well, you could if you had to. I, I that's did true. Be, For emergencies, <laughs> it'd be nice to have around. Yeah, yeah. But I'm just, you know, that's why I do my own now. Helps me save money to buy the juice I love and get. Yep, exactly, lady. Um, yeah, slushy. I've been looking at yours, and I'm always missing something, which really sucks. But, I mean, I don't mind substituting things, but I don't think I'm at that stage yet. I mean, I'm not, like, a beginner, but I'm not you know, well-versed, like to, to try to figure out like what to change it out with. I'm not there yet. So I don't know how long it's going to last me slushy because by the time that I figured out to do the calculator thing, I couldn't find it. So I just figured yeah. I took the two gallons and I, what I do is I divided it by, what did I divide it by? I uh -oh. divided it by because usually to make a 500 of this, well, usually like 400, it's like eight, eight grams. So I divided it into eight grams to see, I think it was. And what did it come out to? It was like, what was it? By gallon. Oh my God. Now I don't know. I went to gallon, gallon to milliliter. And then I don't know. I did something. I don't know. But I just know that, you know, it's going to last me like at least a year. I, I just put in the uh, <laughs> chat, the, uh, that calculator for the vaping apocalypse. Yeah, but I couldn't figure. I couldn't find it when I needed I, it. Well, now you can have it. <laughs> Instead I was of like, all that brain work. So now I, I already figured it out. So I'll be good for a year. For two gallons. And then I was figuring out on the gallons, if I wanted to store it, because I've got two gallons. So one I can leave out. The other gallon, if I want to store it, I think it was 16, 32 ounces I needed or something like that. I don't know. I think with a with a two gallons, you're you're good for years. You think so? Yeah. Yeah. You're at three, you're at three percent, three milligram. Yeah. yeah, you're good for a long, long time. Sometimes I go up to four, 
depending on the flavor. Like sometimes like I'll, I'll be vaping on one and I'll be like, mm, it's for some reason it doesn't give me like, I don't know. And, and I don't do throat hits, but I don't know. It'll just, I don't know what it is. And I'll, I'll put in like another. Um, how, how much juice mess. do you consume a day? That's, that's the main thing. Oh, about almost a hundred mils. A hundred mils a day? Yeah, almost. Well, I, you know, that's hard to do with those little atomizers. I know, <laughs> with the tiny atomizers, it feels like I'm filling it like all day long, you know? It's like every few hits, I'm filling it. Like 20 okay. mill milliliters is just not enough. So I'm definitely gonna have to change it out to the 32. Okay. And then my aromamizer plus V2 holds 28. And I fill that at least three times a day. So yeah, I'm gonna say almost a hundred. I was telling Wendy I had to get my monster set up out because all my 22s were getting nervous. <laughs> Hi Dante. Hi Billy. Hi Aaron. Hi Oscar. So with that you, amount of you can Google that, Oscar. Um, do, do, with do, that do. amount of consumption, you'll you can go three hundred and thirty three point three three days. For what? For one gallon? For what? One. Oh wait, one gallon. I said just said one liter. No, I have a gallon. I have oh, two so gallons. That's, that's six years. Are you sure? Well, how many liters are in a gallon? Four, right? No, because it's metric to gallon. So it's, I think it's almost five. Oh, I don't know. Somebody in chat, <laughs> do your calculations and tell me how long will my nicotine last for two gallons? <laughs> We're not even going to count the, the two 250s I have. <laughs> three milligrams of nicotine is what i vape sometimes four though so we need like a couple extra and i vape almost 100 mils a day that's too much to put in your lungs you better stop that what are you talking about it's not that's a when lot you guys, how many packs per day did you smoke about a pack and a half that said 18.6 years, that calculator. Hi, Chuck in. How you doing? 18.6 so, years. Lady says 3.78541. Not sure what that is. Curtis meters, says 180 meters years. So she said 150 years. <laughs> Kara said 3.75. Is that months? <laughs> so, Hi, timekeeper. Hey, timekeeper. Six years. And my, I, well, it doesn't matter if I do. I always vape 80 20. I don't do 70 30. I like my clouds. So you're good for Hi, over, Aussie. over six years. Ozzy. You're Oh, really? Okay. So by that time, we should be fixed, right? I, I would hope so. Yeah, that's well, what I'm it, hoping for. It took the vitamin supplement industry 13 years. It took the pot industry 50 years. Yeah. <laughs> I just, <laughs> just back. How you doing? Jeff Prince, how you doing? I vape around 13 miles a day. Good. Timekeeper. All right, so 7.57 liters is two gallons. So I figure out how many. Okay, so 180 I years, I should be okay. <laughs> <laughs> By that time, somebody's got to give. <laughs> Hi, Tetley man. Tetley. Hey, Tetley. Oh, I don't, well, think about it. My Aromamizer Plus holds 28 mils. I fill that out. I fill that up at least three times a day. Vaping on this one that holds 20 mils of e-liquid, this one I fill up about five, four to five times a day. So if I'm vaping something like this, I fill it up, I counted the other day, 32 times. In one day, you fill that up? I toss it out the window. <laughs> That's like, ridiculous. This is, that's why I carry this and this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't feel like getting up again. But I literally, but I have the RBA in here and I'm loving the RBA in here. So I, I just, I can't let, let it go. I just can't. I really like that mod. How heavy is it? It's not too heavy at all. It feels substantial in the hand though. And the black one, what's funny is the black one. Can you see the color it's turning? Greenish? Like a blue teal. Look. Yeah, it's pretty. And pretty. Um, 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 what's her name? Um, I, I, I forget in, my, in the group. Hers turned purple. And I was like, ooh, it's like a surprise. It's like a jack-in-the-box almost. <laughs> I'm like, I'm loving it. Because at first I was like, man, it's just black. And then I was like, wait a minute. 
It's it's turning blue. Blue, like an oil spill thing. Yes, look at it. See it? That's nice. I love it. Amber says I'm good for five years. So I two weeks ago we did we did a call. Oh really, Slushy? How do you know if it's bad? So she says that he got a bad batch from um, Nick River or River Supply. Oh, bummer. Well, if you get it in and it's brown, I would call it bad, but I don't, I don't know. No, mine's not brown. I got I one down, I got one more coming. I haven't heard anything really bad about Nick River or uh, River Supply. And oh, yeah, I, I haven't heard about that. This one here or this one here, Nicole? The small one, this is actually the Lost Vape, um, Ursa Quest, and it comes in a kit. You get two pods. One is for like um, smaller amount, I want to say, because it still gives you really great clouds. And then the other one is the Pro Pod, and the Pro Pod you can actually use the UB Pro RBA, which is what I have in here, and I absolutely love it. And I have one waiting, um, already ready to go for the sub ohm tank because they also have a sub ohm tank, and this comes with a 510 adapter also. So you get the two pods, you get the 510, you get the coils, you can purchase for $10, you can purchase the RBA. And the RBA is a, it's an easy ass deck. You got to watch my review for it. It's so freaking easy that anybody can do it. I promise you. And the great thing is, is say for instance, which is not happening, but just say for instance, you can't buy coils. You can still do round wire coils in the RBA. So it's a win-win all around. You can always get wire. Yep, and then you get the kit, which I have, so yeah. But I'm telling you, it's like, I, I'm i loving it. I love the flavor of it. Plus you've got the outside airflow. Wait, where are we? So you can actually adjust it right from the outside right here. So my fingers, my nails, there we go. My nails getting in the way. It's like, no, Wendy, no, you like it wide open. So there we go. And that kit's like $80, right? It's, it's a good price. I think, but it's so worth it. It takes a 21700. I go through two batteries a day because uh -huh. I gauged it. So for two batteries, which you usually have a dual battery mod anyways, when you have, you know, pretty much and it's just two batteries. Like, and I love that you can put your nail under here because some of these are so hard that you have to go and get a tool. This one, I look, I, ha I never have a problem. And I have thicker nails because, you know, I have the gel on them and look, I can open it up easy. So that is definitely a pro for me. Yes. But just say. <laughs> That's right. That's right, lady. Frank and Miser. Okay. After adjusting 0 0.3, 13, wait, after adjusting 13 years of Nick in stash, and that's not counting the commercial juices I have stashed. Yeah, I'll be part of the choir invisible by the time I run out. <laughs> <laughs> So, so we all still going to have, yeah, batteries are, they make 18650 batteries, 21, so those are actually used by flashlights and computers and things like that. So they're never going to be able to stop making batteries because they're not made just for vapes. It just so happened that the vapes were made for those batteries, but the batteries were not made for the vapes. Hi, Brandy. Hi, Brandy. Yeah, everybody just needs to stop freaking out about that part. That part, VG, PG, flavoring, all that's going to be okay. Um, and some companies, I think, I forget who it was that I read, um, they can't deliver, you know, um, retail-wise, but they can always send to, um, to different shops. So if you have a shop near you, they can ship it there. If you, you know, talk to your shop, you can have that done. I mean, there's always going to be a way around it. We're going to find a way. We're going to be, we're going to find a way. Hi, Richard. None of us can give up. See, that's what happened with cigarette smoking, why it didn't go away. They tried to, to do prohibition with that and it didn't work. Now you buy them everywhere. And as a matter of fact, anything that's healthier than a cigarette, they're getting rid of. So if cigarettes can make it, I don't see why vaping, which is such a healthier alternative, can't. The difference is, is we all have to put in our two cents. 
We all have to keep fighting the same fight. We can't just leave it for like a hundred people to fight. We all have to, to get together. If you really want it that bad, then you need to you need to sign up for CASA, sign up for, for other things. Anytime that you see something to fill out, like to put your signature on, do it. I've got one in my group going on right now that I think Michelle came up with. Um, I've also shared it on Twitter. Anytime I see any of those, I'm always filling them out and sharing them. Um, yeah, we'll always find a way. There's going to be, I mean, come on. Do you know the cigarettes that some countries, and I think I saw this, um, where was it? Where was it? Where was it? Was it Germany? Oh, was it Germany? It was or Russia or something. They're still um, going under the radar and doing like um, um, those um, balloon things to get them across the borders oh, wow. for cigarettes for cigarettes oh my god yeah, like we could do that with a vape <laughs> <laughs> yeah they, i mean they, they, because cigarettes are outlawed to sell them outside of like stores and they're actually doing that i mean there's a lot of documentaries on it so let me tell you i mean they, they can't take it all away yeah we're not gonna let them wendy no, I, I know I'm fighting. So if y'all are interested, come along. Yeah, Hi, Ross. Hi, Mandalorian. Mary. Hey, Mandalorian. Mary. Mary. I've been watching my baby Yoda. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, Greg. Larry's screwing right now. Come on, let's fight. I'm not going to win. Though, so. <laughs> That's it. James Rivera, how you doing, sweetie? Brother James. Hey, Jay. Oh, I got my. Two weeks ago, we worked out. <laughs> Lady Dark Sky says, I got two drones. Who's with me? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Schwen's, Schwen's coffee, right? Schwen's. Uh, oh, tea. yes. Yes. He's asked us about it. I wasn't happy with the one we made. I'll be totally honest. I wasn't happy with it. But I was missing flavors, if I'm not mistaken, which reminds me. Let's go ahead and see what I got. Oh, damn. Yeah, what'd you get? What'd you get? Okay, so I've had this out. I was so excited I had it ready for last week, but, you know, shit happens. All right, so I got more crispy waffle. I got a bigger one because of this. Wow. <laughs> I had to get love. that. What flavor is that? That's the crispy waffle. Okay. And then our crisp waffle. Yeah, crispy. And then I got um, the SSA ice cream vanilla because you had that one and I didn't have it. One of you huh. had it. I have it. Okay. One of you had it. I knew that. I, I know I'm copying somebody. <laughs> <laughs> I got um, Wonder Flavors white chocolate milky cream. Does that have no white chocolate? Oh, I don't have that one. Ooh, I got one. What did you got? What the hell? I got Waffle Cone by Flavor West because I didn't have that either. So I want to try sometimes, you know, to change it up, see what I can do. I got dessert chocolate from SSA. This thing is black, or is it the bottle? That's the bottle. You picked all the um, SSAs I never, I didn't pick. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know, you wouldn't do the chocolate. I got guava from SSA, because I do want to make something with guava. I want to make a guava cheesecake. That's what I want to do. Mm. Um, so that whenever I have that in my head, I'll go and I'll start doing things. I got Nature's Flavors Fruit Punch. I don't know why I did. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> it just um, Nature's Flavors Ginger. This is just plain ginger because remember I didn't have a ginger? I don't know why you're buying Nature's Flavors. I didn't approve that. Hi, Scuba. I got Nature's Flavor Butter. <laughs> Nature's Flavors? I got Nature's Flavors Burnt Sugar. Oh, I think they were on yeah. sale or something. I don't know why in my brain... Someone else, oh, D Daytime Frank got a whole bunch of nature's flavors. He got like 13 of them. And I'm like, why? Why? Why not, though? Because they're hideous. How do you know? Because I've had a several of them and it's like, and it's like well known in the okay, industry. But what if you didn't have this one? This one is the Kona cream. What if you didn't have that one? Then I'd be okay with it. <laughs> what if you didn't have the Zab? The Baglioni. If you didn't have the Baglioni, from I heard that one. Daytime Frank said that one smelled really good. Uh, and then I have Cookie Dough from Nature's Flavors. 
All right. So I, don't ask me. I, honestly, if you ask me right now, I must have been sleeping when I ordered because I don't remember ordering any of those. <laughs> I do remember the Kona cream because I looked it up on Google to find out what the hell it was. And I remember that I said, oh, OK, that sounds good and got that. But all the others, I don't know. It was okay. the night you woke up at four in the morning. Eureka. And you ran. No, in. that was the one that I had a Eureka. It wouldn't have been that morning. <laughs> Hi, Erwin. Then I'm I got tiramisu from Flavor Art because I didn't have that one. Which you guys one? had this one. Tiramisu. Oh, I don't have that one. Flavor Art. Uh -oh. Somebody had it in a recipe. Oh, I might it's have probably that. slushy, knowing my luck. <laughs> That's the one I run from all the time because it's it's like you just can use a toothpick worth of Red flavoring. Lane. That's what you were talking okay. about. So I had to get it. Uh -huh. And I got Capella waffle because it, I was in the waffle mood because I was making my waffle stuff. Hi, Grizzly. Then I got s'mores cupcake from Wonder Flavors because it's s'mores and it's cupcake. Heck yeah. And I think I got that from another recipe. It could have been scuba. It could have been somebody here, slushy. It could have been somebody. I don't know. Um, then I got TFA guava. Because again, I want to make guava cheesecake. I have Flavor West sweetener. I haven't tasted that one, but some people use that. I got SSA cactus because I thought I, I have one, but I think somebody's been using SSA, so I got it. I don't know. I got Chem Novatic vanilla pudding because I love vanilla pudding. So I figured since her donut was good, I wanted to try that. That's approved. Then I got um, Mullenberry s'mores, brownie s'mores. Like... They're brownies and they're s'mores. Like, <laughs> I think I was hungry that day too. Then I got <laughs> flavor of green tea. When you're hungry. This green tea, you know what it is? We need to make it. I forgot who in chat made it, but it's a green tea cheesecake, I think it was. Mm. Um, so I have the recipe saved, so I can always forward it to you guys, but I want to try that one. So Green tea by who? Green tea by Flavora. Oh, cool. Do you have that one? I do. Yes. Okay, so uh, peanut butter by SSA because remember I was missing it and you guys had it and I didn't have it. And ripe coconut SSA because I love coconut. Nice. Now, nice dash. I do have an issue. Now you've seen all the things that I have for my for my flavors, right? You're out of I literally rope. need a whole nother four or five things because I have a box there with flavors in it that I have nowhere to put them. And now I have this one. And just wait till the Wonder Flavors drops. You're going to have about 24 new Wonder Flavors to deal with. I know. So what am I going to do? I don't know. I'll figure something out. It just keeps but, growing yeah, and growing. You have to update your like your Tinder profile and, and say you're looking for a carpenter. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't get Malaysian guava. Sorry. Oh, that's a good one. That's so good. But isn't the anything that I think it was um, something that's called a Malaysian guava, if I'm not mistaken, is actually uh, what do you call it that I'm allergic to? Mango. Oh, the Malaysian guava is a mango. If I'm not mistaken, I know that there's a mango out there that's called maybe it's an African something, but I think that that's one of them. Hi, about. So we've got those. So I definitely want to make that green tea today. Um, I got to find that recipe and send it to you. I know I have it saved in my phone because every once in a while I'll just go through these recipes. And then, of course, before I get emails from all of you guys, because I know that you guys are really nice and you're my friend and you want me to know about your recipes. So you keep sending me your recipes and I'm like, oh, oh man, I got to make that. Oh, man, I got to make that. Oh, man, I got to make that. So thank you so much for sending me your recipes through my email. <laughs> yeah you're gonna have to get a nail polish wax for those walls behind you i'm thinking about doing that i'm seriously thinking about doing like but the thing is i think they only hold like 133 yeah that's not very many that's like two of my racks hey i made another uh 30 of our peanut butter custard oh that sounds good that sounds good Gesundheit. Richard Willis, how are you doing? I don't know if I said hi to you already, Scuba. I've already called you out like four times. You're like my man. Doobie doobie doobie. Hi, hi. Um, oh, is that how it works? Whatever man's on the channel, that he's your man? Like when yeah. Is well, no, because I was mentioning Scuba and Slushy, so technically they're both twins, you know, for me tonight, but, you know. I mean, I, I never discriminate. I'll take them all. 
<laughs> but yeah, so Malaysian guavas are real and they are magenta. Okay, that that's a color. Hi, Swaggy. Cool. Kathy Gibbs. <laughs> Kathy Gibbs said, I told my daughter I wanted another mod for my birthday next week. And she said, one was enough. I said, it was, I need it for a backup. You need several backups. You well, don't ever want to be left without yeah. it. Okay, Richard, thank you. Yeah, I have at least a couple, especially. I now. mean, a couple, 10. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know. But yeah, so I don't know. Every single time I get a recipe, I'm like, oh my God. And then I'm, there's somebody, I forget who it is now. If you're in chat and you know who you are, there's one that I guess I found one of his recipes and I'm like, damn, I'm, I'm missing. And I put in the comment, I'm missing one. And then I'm like, <laughs> he posted another, or he, he said, if you think that you're going to like this one, check out these. And I'm like, oh, okay. I'm only missing four. There's five rest, um, ingredients. And he's like, LOL, you're too much. I'm like, what? <laughs> it's all my fault? <laughs> Don't be flavor shaming. So, yeah. So, every single time. But I know for that tea, as a matter of fact, let me send it to you guys. Because I know I have it in here. And I've been dying to try it. That's why I got the green tea. Right. So, hold on. Let me find yeah, it. In try, this. Wendy. Yeah, I'm interested to see what percent they used it at. Yeah. There it is. It's called Green Tea Cheesecake, and it's by Mandalorian. Yes. Mandalorian. Yep. And it says, I can make it. Nice. <laughs> Woo. Yes. And then, I, oh, with my nicotine that I'm waiting for, I also went through the sales over uh, River Supply, you know, the flavor sales. I got some flavors coming, too. Nice, nice, nice. I don't know what I got because I totally forgot. And I would be like, well, that sounds, I might use it. <laughs> well, it's going to be like a surprise when it comes. Oh, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So let me see. I'm going to send this via, I'm going to send it to you, Messenger, okay, um, 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 Demillion? Yeah, that'd be fine. If you can just go ahead and share it in chat. I got an why email. Did, why did your thing not have a picture of you anymore? I don't know. Well, hopefully this is the right Dana. See if you get it. That's it. All right. Well, I didn't have a picture of you. You know more than me? More than one? No, I didn't think I did. That's why I was kind of confused. Did you see the confusion on my face? Yes. <laughs> it was crazy. It was like, no picture. Uh, I delete those people. <laughs> here comes the link in chat. Thank you. I figured I did the hard work and found the recipe. <laughs> I do. <laughs> did hey, you? I got an email a little while ago. My DHD tip started in the mailbox. Oh, yay. That's awesome. Okay, so let me close this down. And there we go. Hi, Stu. How are you, sweetie? It's happy and sad at the same time because she's going out of business, too. Uh, who was it again? DHD, uh, Jess Marie, the DHD accessory drip, drip tips. Oh, okay. I know who you're talking about now. When you said it for a minute, I thought I knew, and then I thought I might not know. But then again, we already know tonight that my mind is not fully 100% there. You know, so the, just excuse The girl me. that does these, these ones. Yes. Yeah. That one. Yeah. I Didn't she hang out with um, Lumi yeah, yeah. and... Yeah. Ruby and Grim Green Ruby, and Daniel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. She was on. Uh, they were supposed to invite me on one time and they never did. So ugh, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> I'm well, still going strong. <laughs> if they ever get back together, I'll. I'll, I'll well, put... I'm always here. So my invitation's out. Uh, let me see. Who was I? Oh, Mandalorian. Thank you so much. Yes, you did tell me to enjoy because I was just missing that one. I was so mad. But yeah, we're going to mix that tonight. We are definitely going to be mixing that tonight. Are we going to mix the one? Three, four, five flavors. Are we going to mix the one from from last week? What, which pulled, one? Yeah, I we're going to mix that. But I want to make this green tea. I've been waiting since since January. Okay. <laughs> we'll make this one. I got the other ones written down. We got sweet potato pie. We got butter my floppy disco potato. Take something, Tim. 
That's the one, butter my I floppy think, potato. Yeah, we got that one. So we'll do that one. I have it written down still. But yeah, so we're going to definitely make this green tea because, and if you notice, if you pull up the recipe, it's like, you see me as the second comment and the mandalorian is the third comment saying, thanks, Wendy, hope you enjoy it. Very nice. And I got the green tea February 24th. Yeah. We got to so mix gotta it, Jamila, because Wendy will wake up in the middle of the night. Like with and I'll be screaming for it. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Okay, so why am I not? I'm like, why is this not working? Oh, okay. Duh. It's on Max BG. All right, so I'm putting that in. I'm mixing it to 15 milliliters. And then you want me to share with you, Demilla, at that? No, I'm, I'm doing that myself. I, I want to lower the uh, tea, so. No, no, no. We got to try it just like this. It's going to be too perfumey. You don't know that. I do. But you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, James. But you don't. Hi, Tack. You don't know it. Let's just try hey, it. This ain't my first Rodeo. Oh, you know what? I love the Rodeo Drive highlighter. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. It's like what I'm wearing today. So Okay, I'll make it as it's done. <laughs> All right, thank you. <laughs> God. Kind of All right, so I got the green tea. Now I need to find the else. How do you say that? Elsaya? Acai. Yeah. Mine is not spelled that. The Elsa. I'm going to put the Elsa tea. That got the Elsa good. tea. Cheesecake graham cracker over here. Cheese, cheese, cheese. This should be a big fat one. I gotta go cheese find cracker. my stuffs. And vanilla pudding. I know where that is. <laughs> I love vanilla pudding. And yes, we cheesecake anywhere over here. Oh, I'm so excited, Mandalorian. We're gonna be testing out your flavor. Green and acai. Anywhere is on this side. Right? Where are you? Damn, that was easy, Larry. I got all, all my stuff already. Oh, that's good. Good to know, Scuba. You found the point blank. Woohoo! All he's right. Been, he's been trying to show me how to change the airflow on the point blank, and he, he hasn't been able to find it for eons. That's good. Oh my God, I cannot find I lost my point blank. It's freaking amazing. I have a review for it. It's a good one. Yes, it is. It was one of my favorites until I lost it. And I don't know how ask, I lost it or where I lost Google, it. Ask Google where he found it. Maybe the, yours is in the same spot. Yeah. <laughs> and I could have sworn I had it on my mug because I constantly had it on my um on my green um topside duel. That's where I had it. And then I found the tops the profile RDA and I moved it and I can't find it because I want to put it on my purple one. Did you give it to your daughter? Oh, no, I think I had it on my purple single. That's why I had it. No, I didn't. I wouldn't have given that to her. It was rainbow. She don't. Crazy? No. <laughs> no. Rainbows don't go to anybody. Rainbows are mine. You share rainbows. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. You're of. Uh... I will deny it to the end of days. <laughs> You got a heart of gold and rainbows. I know, I know, but shh, don't tell nobody because I came up with my rainbows. I'll give them all the ugly colors. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we got the yeah, the cheesecake graham crust. Hey, one of these days you need to try that cape on and let me know what you think of it. I was so going to pull it out last night and I was sitting on the couch and I'm like, okay, I'm going to go in five minutes and I passed out. <laughs> and then I woke up. I love, see, I keep saying it, and it happens to me every single Sunday. I literally have such anxiety on Sunday nights. I literally, that's why I'm tired. I didn't get to sleep last night. I had one of those sleeps where, like, you close your eyes, but you're not really asleep. Your body's relaxed as if you were asleep, but your mind's still racing. That yeah, was me yeah. last night until 3 30 this morning. I know that feeling. And it's just, it really, it but, happens to me every single Sunday, though. Every single Sunday. 
it was kind of magic how that disappeared when I retired. It's crazy. I, that's what I'm thinking that would happen. You know, if I retired, I probably don't worry so much. There we go. Yeah, every single Sunday. And I even went and bought um, a jigsaw puzzle because that used to relax me sometimes to see if that'll help me because my anxiety has been getting so bad. What about uh, reading? Reading used to help me. Reading because my eyesight's getting worse and worse and worse. It's, it's giving me anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not, I don't mean to laugh, but just. Hi, Harry. 26. Harry, 26? No, I'm, I'm counting. I'm like, I need this to be 26. And hi, Harry. <laughs> hi, Harry. Best builder. What are you WTFing? Huh? I'm not going to waste my monetization for that. <laughs> uh, green, point eight. So. So this, this will be. This must be a big batch. It's, hi, Robert Albert. How you doing? That Larry made. Smash that like button, baby. Hi, Jamarius Finney. How you doing? I just like saying Finney. Oh, because he, he did it uh high VG one. Oh, he did? That's why, yeah. yeah. Private. You are not DTF Rollins, boy. Hi, Rollins in. Hi, Frank. Did I miss anybody? I hope I didn't miss anybody. While DTF, I was what's up, brother? DTF, DTF, DTF. Nobody's DTF right now, only Frank. Why? Frank is DTF. <laughs> Hi, Carmen. How come the melon's so quiet over there? Hi, Forrest. I'm trying to find my uh, flavorings. I can't find my green tea flavor. It looks no, like you got to find it because you said you had it. It's in the big bottle, DeMille, in the big glass bottle. Oh, shit. The only one I have like that is the uh, sweet tea. Oh, okay. I mean, the. Right, uh, and it's in the medium bottle. Coconut. There we go. I had to uncheck Max BG. Oh, uh, that's what I had to do too. I was like, where's my limit? Hi, Alexandria. How are you doing? Amanda Larry <laughs> says, you should know. By now, I always do. I know. You I should know. That's You're better. such a max guy. Terry, how are you doing? Order a lot of juice. How long can it last? Depending on how much juice you're buying and keep how much you bake. Keep it in a cool place uh, at a set temperature and uh, out of the sunlight. It'll last a long time. Point two three. Maybe a couple Maybe. years. Come on, thirty-three. Thirty-three. Now he's thirty-three. He's not thirty-one no more. No, not anymore. Okay, I think I got that. <clears throat> Look, I had made this just to make my my um waffle recipe. Ooh, green boy, these bottles are noisy. <laughs> The ones that made out I'm of doing good, Alexandria. Thank you. Yes, yeah, we cheesecake. Mmm, smells so good. That TFA graham crust, cheesecake with graham crust. Oh my gosh, yes. Wordy noises, Wendy. Oh, I love those noises. <laughs> I like the way my my coffee came out, my Schwen coffee. I don't know. It was something about it I didn't like. And then he reached out to me. I'm like, I was not on Monday. I couldn't do it. Usually we do the recipe things on Mondays, and I just couldn't. I mean, I'll give him the recipe, and he can try to make it and see. Georgia boy, how you doing? Of course, of course. The thing is I get so many requests and I started before I used to go ahead and just accept them all. 
But then I get so many creepers that are messaging me once I've accepted them because they they won't go into the um into the other box or the the what do you call it the spam box if you're friends with them. So I I don't now just randomly just accept anybody. So sometimes I miss people. So this weekend I was trying to go back and see who I missed. So that's how I added you. But I get too many, like literally my box is full. Like all the time when I was um, accepting just everybody. Now I, I'm sorry. So I do apologize. Probably why I can't get to my 10K for my Instagram, which I really, really am still waiting to try to get there. And I'm really, really upset because I can't get to my 10K. I'm literally at the same spot I was two months ago. I'll get two, I'll lose four. I'll get four, I'll lose two. So Damn it. hi, Tony. I'm 55, look 41, I feel 85. <laughs> that sucks. I get what you mean though. Dante. <laughs> I worked with a guy for years, Dante. He was a millwright. He was a riot. Oh my God. He was so much fun. Kevin Smith says the flavors covered has eaten to million. <laughs> <laughs> I look through all of my Flavora and it's, I don't- It's gotta don't, be there. Maybe you mislabeled it, it's in the box. Well, if it's in another box, I'm screwed. No, it's in the other box. I have two Flavora boxes and I check both boxes and it's not under tea green. It's not under green tea and it's not under any of the rest of them because I looked at every label. Yeah. Is it in your stash? It's got to be there. I bet you you mixed it with SSA. <laughs> 17.5. Hi, <laughs> Deb, Yeah, It won't count if you do it two times. <laughs> you could try it, though. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Yeah, I'm going to be yeah, sick. You got that, Advocate. 62 this year. I'm looking forward to it because I can start collecting Social Security. Right on. Yes. Yeah. I just want discounts at the store, like Denny's. <laughs> you, know I really, you know what really sucks, though, Wendy? Huh? When you start getting the AARP stuff in the mail. I used to get that a long, long time ago. And I was like, why? It's like, I'm not dying. I'm not old. My mom always talks about AARP, always. I got a discount from this because my AARP, I'm like, well, when I get your age, I'm getting it too. <laughs> How you doing, Snens? Howdy, Tuna, I'm sending you red raspberry flavor drops to try. No, it's part of me. Oh, awesome. Thank you, Swaggy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not 35 anymore, Ronald. So. Hi, Ricky Mahoney. I've definitely lived my life. I've been subscribed to them. Been subscribed. On my channel, I've been subscribed. Just saying. Um, so come April, no vape stores online, right? Um, not if it's business to business within the United States. But outside the United States, I heard that um, they're going to be using DHL, I think. Yeah, so, I mean, supposedly... Nobody really knows for sure until it happens. And exactly. If the post I know the reviewers are still going to be able to get the stuff and we get it, everything DHL. So I can't see why not. <laughs> and if, if enough people, if the United States Postal Service gets enough comments, I mean, they can say, That's okay, what I'm hoping. you know, we can ship hardware, we can ship, we just won't do the liquid or they can make their own decision. Yeah. You know. I just wish they would listen. Like, it's just crazy. It just I I it really gets me depressed thinking about all that. It really does. And I think that's part of why I'm I've been under such anxiety because I, I do have depression. So I'm trying to fight it. Awesome, Forrest. Congratulations. So I just keep getting bigger and bigger vapes. <laughs> and it helps me. I know I want to pick up another dual mod, but I, I just can't figure out which one I want. 
A dual mod? Yeah, I think of the Aegis Legend. I would get the Aegis Legend while you can. I think that that's an amazing mod. It's definitely a beater mod. Like you can have it for years. Plus it's got shock proof, dust proof, fall proof. Um, not that anybody's going to put put it in water if you're smart. Um, yeah. Ah, thank you so much, Cloud Chucker. Yep, here it is right here. You know what's funny is that today I was at work, like in my desk out there, I was working, and I swore that this drip tip looked blue, and I'm like, fuck, I thought it was purple. <laughs> it <is> purple. <laughs> That's purple. <laughs> That's gonna say I swore it was. That's the kind of day I've had today, where I'm literally cursing at my mod, and it is what I thought it was. Like, hello. I'm like, all this time I thought it was fucking purple, and it is. Uh, it just, yeah. Okay, I'm all right. <laughs> so, Demilla, what are you gonna sub in? I do it at Sands Green Tea. Okay. I just don't know where your green tea went. I don't know where it went either. That's well, you gotta take it out of your really stash good. then, so that you don't think that you have it. <sighs> it's so depressing when I lose something like that. Oh, remember when I lost one and then I found it? Yeah. Oh. Let me double yeah. check that it's in my stash. Yeah. When is the USPS stopping again? I have it written down. I have Epi it, green tea. I have Flavor green 27th? tea. SSA green tea and TPA green tea. But I don't have Flavora. I haven't seen the Flavora one. Oh, that's so oh, annoying. That sucks. Hold on, I got it. I got it somewhere. Timekeeper says the Jackaroo Duel is a good mod. The Jackaroo Duel is a good mod. That is another that's, good mod. That I have that one. Kind of nice. That one's oh, you know what else is good? Um, the Scar 18. I love the mod. Also, the one I just reviewed recently. Oh my god, what was it called? This one here. This one here is a really, really good mod. Love, love, love it. I use that a lot too. What is it? Um, it looks that funky. one is the is smoke. The morph two. Ah, that's a funky looking. The morph one. two is a really good one, and it holds pretty big addies too. Um, that one's good. Um, even the um, another one is the boo poo Ar Is it the Argus? Yeah, the Argus. That one's another good one. Ah. And this is really, really lightweight too. And it's got that leather feel to it also. Hmm. Those are all good. Um, there's another one. I'm trying but to What's that last one you said? What? The last leather feeling one? Oh, the Vupu Argus. Any of the drags are good. You know that because those have been around for a long time and they're still kicking. So. Those are good. The Lost Vape Thelma, if you want to spend the money, it's a DNA 250C, but it's great. That's this one here. And I really think that they're going to be coming out with the with the doors to swap them out because I saw on the Lost Vape page, they were asking like, would they do like a package of like different colors or would they, so I think they're going to come out with just where you can just switch out the doors and you can just put a different color. So I think they're going to be doing that. This is really good if you want to invest your money. I really think so. Um, because it's a DNA 250C, so it's going to last a long, long time. So I love that one. But what um, do you think about, you know, the like the DNA Evolve is uh, having a fire sale right now where you could get the chips and they're not going to be uh, selling DNA chips anymore. Oh, I didn't hear about that one. It's on their website. Well, I didn't look at their website. Well, they're, they're still going to sell to other countries. Yeah, so they're not going to stop. Oh, it's okay. Be... They're not going out of business. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. okay. That makes sense. Got me all scared on that one. <laughs> the Aspire Mix is really, really good if you like pods. Yes, they can. I think Brandon said the U.S. is 20% uh, of their market. They sell a lot yeah. to China. Ah. Yeah. But that's because they're putting them in the mods that are made over there. So, yeah. But I don't know. I think, I think, um, yeah, any of those that I mentioned are really good. I'm sure that there's more. I have to think real quick. Um, what about the Gruss? I'm actually getting the the updated version of the Gruss. Um, I didn't I didn't get the first one to review, so I don't know. I absolutely, like I said before, I love this one. So if you get the Ursa Quest kit, you get all that that I told you about. 
Yeah. Plus, you can always purchase the RBA and you'll be vaping forever. Um, everybody who has a grass loves it, Damilla. Yeah, everybody that does, I'm getting the upgraded one. I guess they there's something that they upgraded. I don't know what they did, but I'm getting that one. Um, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Um, yeah, the ones that I mentioned are really, really good. Like I said, a lot of the stuff's up in the air, Terry. I would definitely get the Aegis Legend if you can. I really, I really, really love that one. And we should still be able to get <clears throat> from Canada, Europe, and uh, China. You know, yeah. Any, anywhere out of the country. That's true. Amber, did you see that mine's turning like a teal blue? Look, can you see it? It's so cool. The black is turning teal. I'm loving it. <laughs> Can't wait. Yeah, awesome. I have so many coils for this, but I love this RBA. It's I'm telling you, there's only been two RBAs that have really like got me to want to use an RBA because I don't like RBAs. You built that in like two minutes, too. Yeah. It's it takes no time. It's so easy. Um, Hobag, how you doing, sweetie? Yeah, everybody seems to love their grass out there. I just, yeah, the grass is good. This one's good. Anything, honestly, from Lost Vape, you can't go wrong. Um, so that's my opinion on that. Okay, so are we trying this? Oh, I didn't wait. Hold on. Damn it. Hold on. Let me yeah, we're trying it. We're waiting on you, Wendy. <laughs> waiting on you, Wendy. The Asmodus... Um, the Almighty was my favorite. The Asmodus, the thing about the Asmodus that I don't like is the fact that just by touching that screen, you can unlock it. And I don't like that. I don't like when all of a sudden I'm on temperature control. That, that really upsets me and pisses me off. And that's what the Asmodus mods do for me. I think they work great. I just don't like that, you know, you can, you can easily just by holding it a certain way because I'm a thumb fire, I was constantly, it would, every time I look, I'm on freaking temperature control. Every uh -huh. time. What kind of vapor are you getting on temperature control? <laughs> I bet you weren't getting those Wendy clouds, were you? <laughs> no, but I could get it on my Wendy, my Wonder Woman Wendy mod. Yes, I could. Because I used to vape the, the ones from, um, from, um, Vaporized Nomads, I used to vape those all the time on temperature control because back then I was strictly stainless steel fuse Claptons, the ones that I made. So I could vape them on temperature control, but the majority of what I vape is in temperature control coils. So I have to be like, oh, you know, especially like you have a sub-ohm tank, you know it's probably Canthal. It's definitely not stainless steel. Yeah. So, you know, for those out there that, that it happens to, I get worried because you can't vape them in those and you don't want to ruin anything. Bye, Robert. Have a good night. Hey, Robert. <laughs> exactly, Hi, Amber. You see what I mean? Then I had totally forgot about it when I bought my second Lustro or my first Lustro. When I bought that one, I was so pissed about it. I was like, damn it. I knew that there was something. And that's what it was. I hate changing it. And I would lock it all the time. I even did it where you have to hit it instead of swipe that you had to tap it three times and it would still do the same thing. So it didn't matter. Yeah, I have one hell of a time with this. This is why it's got dust on top of it the uh what is this the uh, minikin 2 or no is that no, yeah that's the as is, is that the minikin three i think it's a three look on the front it has it right by where the charge port is no it doesn't have it i think no yeah that's i think the, that's the minikin three yeah because yeah. that's the side one yeah it's saying it's a, a battery door it's Hi, a Sasha. Thing. It's a pain in the butt because because it, it, you can't lock the screen, and I kept on changing the um, the watts on it. Yeah, just by okay. holding it, and it, it, oh, it just drove me crazy. That's uh, what I'm telling you. All the every S modus that I had afterwards, I would find because I would be work, you know, doing it all the time. Hi, Michelle. I'm sorry, Michelle. How you doing, sweetie? Hi, Tony. I've been passing around your um, petition just to let you know, just in case you didn't know. Now you know. Because I'm cool like that. I'm your BFF. I put, put Michelle's um, Twitter in chat again. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Do 
Yeah, Scuba. Oh, the really? Bites. Tony says that stainless steel tastes like blood to him. How often are you sucking on blood is what I want to know. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, I've got the Eve Dillo. I just want another another one to go for the stretch. But it's not it's not as if we can't get them from places like from China. Yeah. Because they're not going to lose sales. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, China's going to go out of business. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> they don't give a crap about anything. Oh, I almost I almost vaped it without Wendy. Oh, no, 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 no. I what? almost I had my finger on the trigger. I don't want to I don't want to ruin my Addy by putting this in it. <laughs> <laughs> That acai just smells so. Oh, it's gonna be yummy. Perfumable. A spicy. You're cheese welcome, cake. Michelle. You know what? What got me, Michelle? It was so funny because I was over. I think it was in the Steam Crave. It was on the Steam Crave um, group, and I went to go post something, and somebody had your link there because I didn't even know about it. And whenever that happens, Michelle, and you have petitions and stuff like that, just go ahead and post them in my group and just say that I approved them. Um, but I didn't know about it, so I went there, and he says. <laughs> if I can sit here naked and fill this out real quick and it doesn't take long, you can too. And I was like, that's so cool. I want to sign it. <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny the way he said it. It was just hilarious. Is so. that how Michelle writes her, is that how she writes her romance novels? Yeah. In her birthday suit? Definitely. <laughs> That's so, no, it was some guy that was that had posted it. And then it turns out that I had liked his post and then he actually um, commented on one of my videos, my my um, Titan one, and was like, oh, thank you so much for liking my post. And I'm like, of course, I even copied it. That's on my list, but Dad. Yeah, don't, don't share from somewhere, Michelle. Post it in the group because you have to remember that if you're posting or sharing from another group to a private group, Unless the person looking at it is got is a member of both groups, they won't see it. Just a little hint for that. Um, so don't share it like group oh. to group. Sh put it in, yeah. So say for instance, I'm I'm a, a group member of Lost Vape and my group, and I go and I save like Lost Vape. I forward something from there. I share something from there. If you're not in the Lost Vape Vape group, you're gonna see where it says post cannot be seen or something. That's why you see them. You're not a member of the group that it was shared from. Oh. So, yeah. So don't ever do that. Not in private groups. If it's an open group, you can do it and everybody will see it. But, yeah. <clears throat> so. Facebook's the devil, Wendy. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, no, it's for a reason. Because if it's a private group, why would you allow other things to come in or your stuff to be shared? I get it. If you have to be a member to a group, you have to be accepted in, they're not going to want you to share something from their group. So I'm just letting you know, because that way a lot of people, yeah, you, it, don't do it. Always post an original post. If you share something, not everybody can see it. That's why you see those messages all the time with the white box that you yeah. can't see, right? That, that the post is not available. It's because you're not a member of that group or wherever it was forwarded from. I always get like the same post like three times in a row because I guess I'm connected with those groups. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. so and like, if it's the same oh, person that's, 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 that's posting in all the groups, you're going to get it. Yeah. Hi, Papa that. Stormy. I get that all the time, too. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just get added to groups left and right. And it drives me crazy because I don't have time for my own group. Hi, Papa uh, Stormy. Uh-oh, Addy's going to take a hit. No, he's not. Mm. Addy! <laughs> <laughs> this is Valentine's Day hucking. <laughs> okay. Oh. Do it. I, I, want to, I just want to make. I just want to wake up too. Hold on, and I'm talking, so I'm actually multitasking. So give me a little bit of credit here. Deb finally got her jelly box. Jelly, jelly, jelly box. Nice. Yay! And some oh my God, battery wrap everywhere on sale. Club. They even have a new one coming out that's an RDA kit. Because they, they contacted me and they said that they, they were going to send one um, so I can show the new um, updated one that they have. But oh, have that, so. oh, that sucks, Wendy. I don't You're think I know yet. Scuba said that people are having problems with the juice flowing down into the board. For what? The um, jelly box. Mm, not unless they're over dripping. 
I mean, if you're over dripping, this doesn't have like major protections in it. So yeah. if you're over dripping and it's going into the 510, it's going to cause some issues. The problem is, is you actually have to know how to see if your shit is dripping or not. But we're talking scuba. He's dripping all over all the time. Exactly. So like, <laughs> hello, you're overflowing. Yeah. I mean, it's not, it's not a really expensive mod. Think about it. So they're not going to have protections. Like say, for yeah. instance, the DNA, you can drip on it. It'll go in there, but it's not going to mess it up for a long period of time. It's an inexpensive jelly box. And I think that it, for the looks of it, Hey, it's cool as shit. I don't care if it's inexpensive or not. So let's go ahead and mix this up. Uh, Munch poor did. Munchkin doesn't get her, didn't get hers yet. Ah, I hope you get it. Yeah, I know, right, Deb? <laughs> but she just got a fancy mod. Which one was that, Munchkin? Uh, she says scuba oozes juice. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> I said that he like his uh, build mat. He could just squeeze that out and get thirty mils out of it. <laughs> Uh, tastes wow. like a, a fruit punch medley. Okay, I'm dripping. You're dripping? Okay. Yeah, but that's a personal issue. Uh, now I'm going to put some on my mod. You're dripping because scuba's dripping? Yeah, I just didn't want to feel alone. I'm, I'm nice that way. Oh, my group name is Wendy Vapes Hangout. So, sorry about that. I read that and then somebody said something and of course my it was like squirrel, so I just left that. Um, but yeah, it's Wendy Vapes Hangout. Uh, the link is actually in the description below. Yeah, me um, too, Munch Munch Okay, ready? Munchkin just got the Centaurus. It's beautiful. Cheers. Here you go, Larry. Cheers. That's pretty good. I like it. I like it too. Tastes like a flower. <laughs> <laughs> You're a flower. How are you? Oh, the Millen is a flower child. She was yeah, she's down there with it. flower power. I'm a dirty hippie. I, I'm a flower power. Hippies were born down there, weren't they? Hi hippies were what? Were born down there where you live. Oh, yeah. We had the summer of love right here in the city. Yeah. 1969. Yeah, baby. Mm, that's good. I think that's good. I really like it. Good job. So Larry. what is this steep time? Did it say a steep time on this? He didn't mention it. Is there a steep time to this? Probably three, four days for the TFA cheesecake. But people need to put this in their recipes. Your Mandalorian. Yeah. Gosh, Mandalorian. If you don't put it in a recipe, how am I supposed and, to know? And it's not a baby Yoda, it's a baby alien. He was I could I could feel him screaming that. <laughs> Even though it's somewhat floral, it's pretty damn I'll good. Yeah, it's I like good. it. I, it's yeah. got a, like a, a different type of taste to it. Hi, Arnie. It's nice and Arnie. smooth. It's um, it's it's nice, different cheesecake. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. That yes, I don't know. I'm getting fabulous. like a yeah. I'm getting like a coconut note to it. I think that's, that's yes, we cheesecake. And it's good. It works with it. Very nice, Mandalorian. Mandalorian, I finally got it. Off the shape for three, four days. J no, then it's one or the other. You can't have it both. Right. Off the shape, no. yeah, it's all right. But when is it fully there? <laughs> now, when you get you try somebody else's recipes, you have to leave them a rating, right? Yeah, I'm at, well, in three, four days, I'll leave them a rating. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll leave them a rating. <laughs> Because it can be off the shake or three to four days. So how do, do, how do we do minuses on this thing? Tastes like a damn flower. Yeah. I'm so giving it five stars. Good job, Larry. I'll wait Good till job, Larry. Down. I love it. The smoothness is really, really nice. I like that a lot. A lot. That lot, makes lot. me want to put a green tea in there with it. Right? I think you should. I'm telling you, the green tea is not overpowering. So, let me see. Maybe I'll try the green tea by SSA. <laughs> Thanks so much, Terry. No, buy the green tea that I have for this one. I know, can't find it. What are you doing? Well, you should have just put a green tea in then. 
I gave myself a rickety. <laughs> God. I just wanted to see how uh, <laughs> how it was before uh, I went what's your around. Rating? Oh, I just put it down to one star. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Oh God, it's private you anyway. You just do not like your recipe, huh? Holy shit! There, now I'm I'm back on Larry's. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, Mandalorian. I guess he thinks it needs bourbon. <laughs> oh yeah, bourbon would have been great. I don't think I have it. Do I have bourbon? Sweet job. Yeah, do this. Boom. And boom. Did I do it? I think I did, right? Yes. I think I gave you a stars. I know. I'm such a boomer. <laughs> Dark star. <laughs> <laughs> boomer. Yes, it worked. Toonie and I gave you, gave you stars. Nice. Look at that. <laughs> I gotta look on. Yeah. All, right. All right, so we need to make the one for the potato sack, right? The butter my flappy disco potato. Yes, and we have that I, one saved already, or do you have just, the thing? I just put it in chat. Oh, well, okay, fine. Sorry, gosh. Hold on, I gotta write green tea on here, or I'm gonna lose it. Very oh, you have done a bourbon cheesecake, but which one do you like better? What made you want to make a green tea cheesecake? What what came over your head? Like what was in your brain that, that made you want to do it? I like to know the background. A while back there was a huge hit that everybody vaped and it was green tea Kit Kat. And it was delightful because they have green tea Kit Kats now. <laughs> it doesn't, doesn't sound even good. sound the least bit appetizing. It really doesn't. That literally made me vomit in my mouth. Like, no. It's oh, that was a huge hit. Oh, good. no, no, no. Oh, wow. No, you can hit me, but no, not not a huge hit, no. How come the link didn't come up? The, the recipe didn't come Is it in private? It didn't come up? No. Oh, it might yeah. be in private. Oh, uh, well, that sucks. Because I switched it up. You want me to find it? Find it? Yeah, please. Okay, give me half a second. Yeah, share it in private because, yeah. It sounded good. Oh, okay. All right, well, I mean, it tasted good. I love green tea, but I don't know what the Kit Kat, but yeah. Never search bourbon on ELR. You will think I have a problem. <laughs> you made a lot of bourbon. Do I even? I want to check that to see if I have bourbon. Hold on, let me check something. Okay, here's a good link. Okay. Aw, thank you, Michelle. All right, hold on. Let me see if I got bourbon. I keep wanting to order bourbon. I'm not a drinker, so I keep forgetting. I have Flavora bourbon, aged bourbon cream, and vanilla bourbon, which we know is just a vanilla. So out of those, bourbon flavor, bourbon Flavora and aged bourbon cream, are those some of the ones that you use, Mandalorian? He's not that for... monkey, that funky monkey. <laughs> <laughs> He's known right. for mixing all the alcohols, drinks. I like alcoholic drinks, I think. I would have to taste it to tell you for sure. But I think I do. Same. Okay, so. Oh, it says I can make that. Does it mean that I can? <laughs> <laughs> please, please say yes that it's not reading yours. Fast monkey. I can't read that because see, I'm like already like squirrel everywhere. That funky monkey. Ah, yes, lady. Lavora is markers mark. If you mean Marky's mark, mark markers. Markers mark bourbon. Oh, okay. I don't know what that is. It's a brand name of. Of a real bourbon. Of a bourbon. Yeah. At, mark, oh, yeah. so then I got the right one. Cool. Okay, great. Thank you. Apparently, I don't really drink bourbon. I just think I do. Oh, okay, Mandalorian. Then I have the right ones. Okay. <sighs> Finally. Scuba, that drink, monkey, scuba that drinks fighting cock. Yeah, he does. <laughs> oh, he had a cock? 
So does DeMillon on New Year's Eve. <laughs> yeah, I drink all the cock on New Year's Eve, man. <laughs> that fighting cock. That's a good whiskey. Or it's oh, not a whiskey. Yeah, that's what they say. I think it's a bourbon. A size. But it's like a yeah. hundred and something proof, so it gets you wasted, and then you don't really get a hangover the next day. It's amazing. Oh, well, that's always a good one. Not like Jack Daniels, where he pounces like on you for Jack the next three days. I like Jack and Coke. All right, so all these are, other than Flavor West, Flavor West is salted caramel. <clears throat> Salted caramel, where are you? Oh, so it's in our chat. I got it. Yes, of course. Dude. Okay, so we got that one. Got salted caramel. Got Philadelphia butter cake. I remember having that one. <laughs> Shit, don't fall. Oh, that monkey, that monkey. It's no such as private. Did you get it, Wendy? You get it to open? Yeah, uh, the second one. Oh my God, where are you? Philadelphia. Yeah, the second one opened up. Yeah, the second one will open up. Did you get it? Uh, it still, still says private. What's it? Oh, what's the name of it, Demelin? I won't get it that It's, way it's private. No, it's not private if you if you search it. Butter my flappy disco potato. I tried to search it and it was private. It didn't come up. But try it. Just put in butter my flappy disco potato. No, it can't be private because she's got comments on it. And this one is a five day steeper, by the way, because she put it in a comment. Flapper pie is oh that's tam vapes recipe yes yeah i haven't dante bravo i haven't tried gentleman jack or jack select black label oh that's that wonderful pie. 133 proof is jack select black label Ooh. that liquor would be quicker <laughs> oh Butter pecan ice cream one on one is over here. Butter pecan ice cream. Butter pecan ice cream. Okay, I got all my flavors. That funky, that funky monkey. Okay, so I wrote it down. That green pie. Mmm, yum. I love that flavor. Michelle says to keep the wild turkey away from her. Hi, Kylie. <laughs> How you doing, sweetie? Butter pecan, baby. You Boy, better she, pecan. She has pretty high percentages on all these. The wild turkey is no, no, no better to stay away from Michelle's house. <laughs> Ooh, wait. They live I've off the land be, down there. Got to adopt. I almost forgot to adapt. Did you find it, uh, Addy? Yeah, thank you. Oh, He's good. My funky monkey. Raz monkey, 38. Butterscotch cream pie. Yum, yum, yum. Where the hell are you? You should be right in front someplace. Mmm, that smells good. Which one are you smelling? Butterscotch cream pie. Oh, that's the one I was not doing. Why not? Oh, because I didn't get there yet. It's now coming up. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. This one's going to be flavorful with all of these percentages. And you know what Wendy thinks about flavorful? I think Flavor so. in your face, Wendy. Yeah, I like it all over my face. I mean, in my face. <laughs> Look at these Wonder Flavors labels. 0.45. They really go... Uh, oh, yeah. wow. All gnarly on you. Okay. It's okay, Kylie. I totally understand. You know we got you. I think it's because they use the paper labels on these ones. 
Ooh, the flapper pie smells good too. Oh, it's yeah. so good. Oh well. So I'm, I'm gonna have to use the SSA salted caramel. Oh man. Philadelphia butter cake. I think I have that out. Yep. Or is that the river I have? I have some one of them. River or SSA, I don't remember what. It's something. If you had it in your stash, you would know, you know, right? <laughs> it probably is. Just saying. It probably is in my stash. I have like but check your stash. I have yeah, like I'm up to like 170, Wendy. Here's the difference of the two labels from Wonder Flavors. Where one they they fixed wow. them. So it's like the better kind of label, and then the other one's still the paper label. It's River yeah, I don't Supply. Know. I know I used it before. It's really good. Sixteen forty-six. So my waist's been kicking my ass in golf lately. Oh, that's not good. You need to show her up. I keep trying. She just keeps beating me. <laughs> just, just keep telling her that you're that you're letting her win, and it will jinx her. <laughs> she, <laughs> she says you're letting me win. I says no, I'm not. <laughs> no, start saying yes, you did. It'll jinx her. No, that'll that'll, <laughs> that'll make her angry. I know that'll because but she'll forget about how to play because she'll be so <laughs> angry. <laughs> I don't want to make her angry. She's Lebanese and Italian. Sicilian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, do you want to win or do you want to win? That's what I want to know. I want to stay alive. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, then you don't care about winning. <laughs> but having you lose so many times, sir, wouldn't she get bored of winning all the time? <laughs> nope. <laughs> like, you know what? You're not even any fun anymore, babe. <laughs> all right. Buttercream, butter pecan, butterscotch, butterscotch, pepper, Philly. Man, these are some awesome Hi, flavors. Tyra. Now I got to start thinking about what I want to put my nicotine. Hi, Billy. In. <laughs> what do you want to do? I got to start thinking about what I want to put my nicotine in. Like, um, you, know, you can get those glass bottles. I can send you a link. No, no, no. I mean, like, do I want to use this nicotine on this mix and waste my nicotine? Oh my gosh! <laughs> you have two gallons too, don't you, Demilla? Hi, Mamanita. At least. Yeah, don't even worry about it. I know. I'm just joking. Worst comes. No, to you're worst. not. You've been saying it all night. <laughs> worst comes to worst, you can get some nicotine from from Toonie. Yeah, Tuni's got at least for three years. Boom, my whole top popped off. I got e-liquid everywhere. That happened in the pre-show, didn't it? Oh, no. That no. happened to me in the pre-show. That was my top, not this oh. top. <laughs> and that was kind of on purpose by mistake. Okay. Um, Let me go find the top for this. Hold on. I'll pick a oh, one that can This is what, like a 20, 25? No, they're all still, still talking about alcohol in the chat. <laughs> hey, monkey, monkey, monkey. Maybe we should have an all alcohol day. Oh shit! You uh -oh. Okay. Yeah, just my um, my what do you call this box light, girl? She fell down on her butt. That's just my box light. I got it. What is going on over there? That funky monkey. Well, let's see. I, what's today? The fifth, sixth, seventh. Eight. Fresh should be fresh should be eight. moving in today. Today's the eighth. I worked today. They closed on the fifth. They were gonna have cleaners go in, and then they, on the sixth, and they were gonna fumigate it on the seventh. And I think probably move in today. Oh, awesome. Yeah, because I think his parents were coming in on the 10th or something to oh. help get situated. Yeah, that's Wednesday. So, yeah, he's probably moving in today. I have 
two gallons, Papa. So you don't have to feel sorry at all. I got one gallon already and another one coming. I think I'm getting it Wednesday. I'm having company come this weekend. You are? Your sister? My sister and her husband and her brand new nine-month-old puppy dog. Oh, fun. Oh, so, uh, that's what oh, they call them now? So pipe and I, oh, don't even say that. This family here now. <laughs> No, Piper and uh, Lola are gonna. It's gonna be a trip. So oh, that's awesome. How long are they gonna be there for? Uh, about four, just four days. Oh, I was gonna say you could bring Angela on next Monday. Yeah. Oh no, they're leaving early Monday morning. Of course, of course, you keep saying that. Oh. Hi, Capozzi. How you doing? Capozzi. Oh, there's already a recipe, an amazing glazed donut recipe. Hold on, I'll put it in chat. That this one actually fresh made and I've made it and it is so good. Like when I tell you it's so good, I promise you, hold on. It's called Krispy Kreme. It was actually made for Michelle Hughes. Krispy Kreme donut, I think it's called. Oh, I'm getting a plethora of flavors out already. Oh, what is it, donut? Oh my three. Michelle's Krispy Kreme donut. That's what it's called. Hold on, let me go to his right here. Recipe was adaptable. Are we gonna make it? Here you go. No, um, 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 um. Lady was asking about it. Yeah, I think the new. Yeah. I think the new Wonder flavors are getting ready to ship. Really? Yeah. Man. Well, I, I'm getting ready to ship where? To the uh, distributors. Oh, okay. That's cool. Yeah, this glazed donut is great, but you got to make it with avocado. That's for that mouthfeel. Michelle, I remember making this for you, and I went and I wrote it down. Oh, my God. I literally wrote it down that day and then ordered the avocado. I bet you that would be good. Oh, it's by Fresh. It depends on the flavor. Yeah, this is Fresh's. He made it on one of the shows that we were on. And, oh, my God, which show was on? We were on together, so I know that it was like a charity thing. And Michelle had asked for a glazed donut, and he made that one for her. And ever since then, I've known about it. And I have it. No. Oh, <laughs> sorry, lady. <laughs> But it's really, really good, I promise. <laughs> so this is like, oh my God, so good. 21. If you're looking for a good cake donut, Chem Novatic Donut is a really, really good cake donut. And you can- Yeah, that's the one that, that Demela likes. I like the avocado in mine. That was so long ago we made that donut though, huh? Yeah. Do we still have it here? Hold on. You named it boobies. <laughs> I love boobies. All right, so that Blaze, one was this Blaze one. the boobie. Um, dun, 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 dun. The Midland's boobies. Yes, it was your boobies. That's when we made it. It was three ingredients, literally. But we made a blueberry one. I would like to have one without the fruit and see what it tastes like like a glazed cream filling yeah oh with some powdered sugar on it some bavarian cream inside of it <gasps> oh i love it when it's got cream inside of it <laughs> <laughs> just say <laughs> okay so i have one more work to do and that's for this one yes are we tasting it I had I'm a for a second there, I was like, what the fuck are we making it? Butter my flappy disco potato. Okay, got it. I literally could not remember. I'm still trying to vape down the acai. Oh, well, hello. I don't have a fresh Addy like you. I've got five fresh eyes like me. <laughs> Somebody asked me one time, they were like, 
Hey, in one of my juice reviews, I had like five e-liquids, which I know I used all five of the same Addy because that's my Nudge 22. He's like, which Addy did you have on whatever mod it was? And I'm like, well, they're all the same. So it doesn't even matter the mod. They're all Nudge 22 by Watopo that's been discontinued. I don't know why they would discontinue this. I think it's like such a great freaking RDA. Did, did you do Especially the uh, flavor testing? The Vodafone Smart Coil? Yeah, I did that one. So I, I, I just bought one. It's on its way. It's a really good one. Yes, it fits Vupu, it fits um, Vaporesso, and it fits the Watofo one. Yep. I wonder, Absolutely. I wonder if my if it would be my sister proof. Oh, that would be pr what, what? Because you said that she's got like pod style devices, right? Or sub ohm tanks. She's got sub ohm tanks. So she's got the. Uh, if she got the the PMP pod. Yeah, she has a Geek Vape uh, Zeus. No, it doesn't fit that. It doesn't fit that. It fits the PMP any PMP pod tank. So I don't think she has a PMP. Yeah, but the PMP pod tanks are really really inexpensive. And if she, she can make her own coils, I mean, it's like, mm, hello. But you do got to keep buying the guts from them. Well, no, the whole kit will include six coils. You can make six coils out of one kit. That's good. And then I think they sell an extra pack where you can get 10 of each, 10, right. 10 coils and 10. Exactly. Trips. Scuba is saying that he wants to make a regular round wire build with it and see if he could jack around with it to make it work. Oh, he can jack around with whatever he wants. <laughs> he is, he is. Who's going to stop him? I'm just asking for him to video it. He is awful juicy. <laughs> just make sure you put that on camera or it didn't happen. I, I mean, Munch, Munch can attest to do it. Yep. Yep. Yeah, on Scuba Show, he's talking about it and he was showing it off or whatever. And of course, there was a bunch of us in chat had to go out and buy them right then and there. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I did that review. I think it was like the, last week I did that review. I mean, I've watched so many reviews of it. I, I, I didn't remember if you were one of them. Um, hello, I'm the one with the nails doing it and the men were fiddling. And yet a woman with nails can just slide it right in. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> just saying. <laughs> And I think that's the one that I actually, at the end of the video said, <laughs> and I don't want to hear no shit about nails because I could do this better than most can. All <laughs> right on. I, I guess I missed yours then. I would have remembered that. Yep. I say, if you don't like nails, this is not the channel for you. I haven't seen any of those comments in a while. That's because they go to the the um spam hold for review yeah and sometimes when i'm feeling really edgy i'll go and i'll approve it and then pin it that way everybody can see what assholes they are yes it's like they're i guess they were never taught if you can't say something nice don't say it at all a lot of people all, though, i had one say well i guess i'm not going to watch any more of your videos and i'm like okay <laughs> Have a nice day, asshole. Uh, you were just a dick to me. Why would I want you here again? All right. Yeah, I'm, I... I'm waked up and I'm juiced up. Wendy's vaping at it anyway. You're busted. <laughs> How Dude. is it, Wendy? <laughs> this is good. <laughs> that would have taken the whole bottle and then some. I would have only filled that up halfway. Hey, this probably needs a steep. Yeah, because I'm not getting way too much flavor. And I even overdid some of the flavors by accident. I need to get my nails done really, really bad. I hope you guys don't look at them. This is going to be good. This is like a five day on the flapper pie. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it says five day in the in the comment. Somebody asked and she said five days. But yeah, I definitely need my nails done. I can't wait for Saturday. I the, really butter, the butterscotch um, pie is like three days. Three, four days. It's going to be good, though. Deb, I got it from the uh, Wodafoe main 
Watofo main site. Yeah. Because nobody else has it in stock. Michelle, for me, because my nails take so much time, I literally, I don't like waiting. And um, my nail lady gets swamped. So I literally go two hours before she opens and sit in the parking lot. And usually I'm the fourth one there. Some days you go there and she's closed because it's a holiday. She's done that to me twice. Yes, or her daughter's in town or something. Oh my God, that shit was freaking, I was, we were sitting there for over three hours and I'm like, I don't think she's coming. And it just ruins my whole Saturday because I have to wake up at like five o'clock in the morning just to get my nails done. That's crazy. On a Saturday. It's crazy. This just to pay for the privilege. Yep, butter my floppy. Isn't, you just go to one of those Vietnam nail places and they coat coat the acrylics on there and they ruin your nails and everything. Oh, no. Yeah. I don't do that. Being that they're my nails, I'm very, very picky. I've never, ever had a fungus or anything because they're my nails and I watch, you know, who I go to. And if for whatever reason I'm questioning them, I won't go to them again. But this lady is so good, you know, and, and I like her gel. It doesn't damage my nails. When she takes off, you know, the gel to redo it, you know, the designs and everything, they're not weak or anything. So I like it. Hi, Kristen. Thanks, Bob. Kristen, how you doing? Woo, woo. Frankie Johnson. Oh, Ordered yeah, it from the be. best vape in Florida. They had super fits. Yeah, if you order, um, Brad's Vapor has them. That would have been super fast too. I just got an order from Brad's in um, last week. Oh, if you guys haven't seen, where is it? If you haven't seen, I did the review for this one. Oops, Custard Monster Blackberry, just saying. Oh, why'd you put that one up? Uh, yes. Oh, no, I didn't. That one's going up. Okay. No, gonna, so you guys better be subscribed. Like, hit the <laughs> bell notification so that you're subscribed. Gonna, you're, you're about to say, yeah, how come you didn't watch it? <laughs> I have a review for that one. I have a review for this one. And I've got three more that I have to do. But the thing is, is that I don't want to overwhelm people with juice reviews. So I try to hold them. They're already done. I just have to release it. Yeah, Brad sent me a, um, a sub home tank as a oh, gift. Oh, that's awesome. Which one? Uh, I'll grab it. Is it the D2? Little Anakin one. That's an Anakin? Uh, oh, I bet you I know which one it is and I can't remember the name of it. What the hell did I do to this drink? Is it the, uh, the Go one? I got no, that. it's not going to be the Go. Uh, he sent me this. Uh-huh, I got one of those. And uh, Anakin Slipstream. I've never heard of that one. Wait, no, I think I have. Like back in the day, that was a good one. Uh, you're gonna like, you're gonna like that one. I'll do, I'm just gonna give it to somebody. No, I think you're gonna like it though. Anakin makes really great tanks, especially for those that don't like something like this. <laughs> yeah, the, the coil <laughs> screws in from the from the bottom. Yes, yes. Ah, it's a nice big coil. That was like the Cleto, huh? Yeah. It has a, a childproof top. Yeah. Those are some crazy coils on the Cleto. Yeah, for sure. That was a good vape, though. Holy cow. Whatever yeah, happened to them? I was really surprised. It was like the first really good sub ohm coil for flavor. And now they're all freaking phenomenal. That's right, David. It came on the original Chroma. That's right. I knew I'd seen it. Couldn't remember. Thank you, David. You said such great help. I appreciate you just, you. you just never know what you're going to get from Brad. You never know. Yeah, I got some. I cotton. like in your face flavors, like just. I got some cotton and I got another Caliburn uh, G. Well, I could still get some, get one. Yeah. The Caliburn G, you want another one? Yeah. They yeah. have them on sale at 101 Vapes for $15. Oh, that's a killer deal. Because they're going out of business, I think. 
And they're putting everything at 50% right now. Holy crap. Just check the shipping because a lot of these places I've noticed, because I've been, I get emails for a lot of the sales and then you go on and it's like $17 for shipping. Mm. And for that, I would rather go to Brad's where I know that it's going to get shipped right and it's going to get shipped to me fast. And he always has free shipping. So I'd rather pay a couple dollars more and know that it's going to, that's just me personally. That's what I do. I actually went. And I bought just in case. Don't ask me why. I was going through the same thing that everybody else goes through. And I went because the profile RDA, the original profile RDA, is my favorite for squonking. And I was like, you know, if anything, just squonk. So I went and I bought like three 10 mesh strip sets from Brett. I went and I purchased them too. Oh, I'm going to have to go so, over there then. I didn't know he had them. Yeah. So see, I got three three boxes so there's 30 mesh coils in there what what type did you get because there's the small medium and large or i got the point no i i got the original profile the original profile oh that's for the profile yeah oh i i was thinking about the mesh strips and stuff for the um p and p coil maker thing No, no 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 this one i no he's got those too but this one I bought because I was just thinking, you know, let me go ahead and get them. That way I have them because I love having backups. I, you know what it is that you go to build something and then you don't have any. So now I know I have some. So it was just. Yeah. Oh, Amber K said Brad sent her the uh, Valerian pod system. That's pretty for. That's a good one too. Yeah, he, he does put extras in also. So what do you get your stuff from him like one day? Because it's like 40 miles away. <laughs> I get it literally in like, well, it depends on the time of day because he'll ship it out same day if I do it early and then I'll get it in like one to two days. But then again, it's USPS. It's not really him. So, and a lot of times it'll pass me, go all the way to Seminole County and then come back. I'm like, okay, I'm in Osceola. Yeah, he just <laughs> drove my past my house. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So Larry C got better. Yeah. But I love the the original profile is my literally my as a matter of fact I have my um my drip witch strawberry in it and it's out there next to the couch. Cuz every wick fit and everything. I'm like, "Yep." Oh yeah, the drag S is good too. Yes, definitely, lady. He's just awesome. Whenever you're ordering from Brad's Vapor, if you use the coupon code Wendy Vapes 10, you get 10% off of anything that you order. Also, he does sponsor the Monday night live streams. So on Mondays, we do a gerbil. And you can't say what it is because it's just a gerbil. And it's something random that Brad's going to be providing because he does sponsor the Monday night live stream for you guys. And um, what we do is we do a a randomizer in a little bit. And yeah, you're going to get it. It's going to be a gerbil. That's That's a squirrel. And a beaver. And a beaver. That's. (laughs) Wow. From Addie's mouth. (laughs) And I have a question for everybody in chat because a lot of you guys are like subscribed and you watch my stuff and everything. Everybody else that I've seen actually um, has like, um, what is it called? The membership thing. I don't know what it is on YouTube where you can actually become a member for like a couple dollars a month or something. But I haven't done it because I don't I don't know what I'm supposed to do for it. Like, do I send nudes? Um You have you have special shows that you zoom with them. Oh, that's what you do? Yeah. I'm like, I don't know any, but I don't think anybody would be interested in it anyway. Because even and I don't mean this to be negative because I did get a super chat tonight. And I do appreciate it very much, but I don't really get those. So I wouldn't want to start something like that and then make anybody feel like obligated. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. I have no idea how it really works, but it seems like they have like, like you could have a sneak peek of the next thing. The problem, Adrian, Robin, is that you do have to remember with my full-time job that I have now, I'm working nearly 60 hours a week. Plus I'm trying to do my reviews and stuff and have time for my family. So having the Patreon, I'm not really as attentive on my Patreon, unfortunately, only because I don't have the time to put in it. If you notice, I don't post that much anymore. 
Um, unless, you know, I'm doing a review and I'm letting you guys know that there's a review out. I don't really have time to post a lot anymore. It's, it's just, my job is like literally taking my life away. So it's really, really hard. I know Terry, Terry Vapor's in a couple, in, in a couple, he's a member in a couple different groups. He might oh, be able to tell you me. what, you know, what benefits they give him. Yeah. Cause I thought it was just like for. I don't know if he's still here. Yeah. I don't want anybody to feel obligated, but the thing is, is like, as you know, especially being that I'm a small channel, I don't make money on YouTube. So like I've mentioned before, buying all the flavors to do these Monday night live streams and stuff like that. It's all costing. It's all out of pocket. Everything that I spend is out of pocket. So yeah, I need an only fans. I thought about that, but yeah, I'm not doing it. <laughs> I was thinking about doing OnlyFans just to show my feet, but I didn't know how many people would do it. But, um, you know, a lot of this stuff is out of pocket. Even for my juice reviews, I go out and I buy the juices to review. So I put everything into, you know, my channel, into reviewing and everything else. So just, it was just a thought. I, um, oh, Curtis says that Zofie does a members thing. You can ask her. She does an OnlyFans. Totally oh, okay. different. Totally different. She doesn't do any nudity, but she does OnlyFans. But again, she's got a bigger channel, so she's going to get bigger numbers. Um, you know. So, and I don't want anybody to feel obligated, so that's why I don't ask for anything. I thought she was going to come mix with us. When? I don't know. What do you mean? Go make I bet sure. she was going to come out and learn how to DIY. Oh, she was going to, but the thing is, is that between her schedule and my schedule, it's so hard. And then on Mondays, remember, as soon as I get done, I need to go to sleep because I have to wake up. She's one that she's up at night. So then she won't want to leave. And then I'm going to be, you know, I can't do that to my job because I, I'm already depri sleep deprived now. So I wish that I could, um, but we'll see what happens in the future. No, I'm just saying, I just wonder what happened with that. Yeah, no, I wanted to do that. And I would definitely do that. But it's just that with her schedule, my it's so hard, especially my schedule. It's more my schedule. But look, I'm working all week long. On the weekends, like on Saturdays, if I'm not going to get my nails done, it takes 15 hours. Then I got to go and see the kids. And then I spend the rest of the weekend doing reviews. I like and then that I edit them during the week. That chat set you guys did was a fun video. I know. No, I wish that I could do it. I would do it in a heartbeat, but it's so hard because she doesn't have, this is her full-time job. Right. You know, I have a real job. Now, and I'm not saying YouTube isn't a real job, but one that I have to clock in and clock out of, and I have to be present every single day. And I have to be present for like 11, 11 and a half hours a day where I'm on that. So it's not like I have, and by the time I'm done, I'm pooped. I'm just like, I can't. I wish I could. If I didn't have a full-time job, if I even had a part-time job, it would be totally different. But I just don't have the time that a lot of these people have. I don't know how you do it, man. And now, because before I was killing myself because I was trying to do my reviews every single day after work. And I was killing myself. So what I'm doing is I'm actually, I'll do the download portion little by little throughout the week. On the weekends is when I'm doing the intros, the outros, you know, because I've already used it. I'm giving my opinions. I already know, you know, what the things are. And then I'm doing the editing. I'm starting on the weekend and the editing takes me through the week too. You could, you so, could do, you could do, do like sub, start subbing yourself out for like a, being a time manager expert. You know, you <laughs> yeah. could do tours. <laughs> Cause so, I mean, so, you, you, do an amazing job at managing your time. Uh, thank you. So when you do your, your intros and stuff, do you have like a rack of about five different shirts so you can put a different shirt? <laughs> no, I do. I was doing that. And I was like, you know what? Forget that shit. If you look at my reviews, <laughs> most of them, well, I try to like, I, cause I do some Saturday and I do some Sunday. So I'm in different and I just try to rotate those reviews. Ah. But they, they, you, they, yeah, if you watch me for during a week, I'm usually wearing like the same shirt. And yeah. it's because I'm trying to do them all during the week. So, like, I had, let me see, I had a whole bunch of red one time because I was wearing red. 
and I was kicking them out. But like, let me see. Like these three in a row have a white shirt. This one, this one, and that one have a white shirt. This oh, okay. one and this one have a pink. That pink went from that one. There's two more pinks. So yeah, I'm usually, because I got to kick them out. I do all the down low and I test them and to give my final thoughts. And then I do that. I'm testing before, I'm testing after. I, it's just, it's a lot of testing. And then you got to go put it all together. And, and that's it. why a lot of times you'll see me look over because as I'm testing during the week also, I'm writing notes for it, you know? Mm -hmm. Because a lot of times I only get one of everything. So I have to use that one for the review and then do the testing afterwards. So then I'll do the review, the download portion. And then for one to two weeks, I'm actually testing the product. Ah. And then I'm giving, that's why I wait to do my final thoughts into the way after I've already done it. And I'm writing notes during the week, like, oh, I feel this way about it. This is a pro for me. This is a con for me. And that's how I do them. Because if not, there's no way to do them. That's a job. Hey, Mad yes. Mock. Yes. Mad yes. Mock in the house. Hi, Mad Mock. Uh, thank you, lady. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, thank you robin good night david dennis hi david dub's cracking me up <laughs> uh thank you chevy chevy i paid good money for an only fans of your feet <laughs> i don't I know like painting my toes or something you know i wouldn't trust michelle with your chicken dub i don't know what they do a lot of chicken breasts on the grill over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my like God. So, you know how I've been having turkey burgers, like turkey ground beef or turkey, yeah. what is it called? Ground turkey, turkey, turkey meat. Sausage. I haven't had ground beef in like forever, right? So, now everywhere around me is out of turkey meat. Ground turkey, turkey burgers are out of it. So, the other day I ordered veggie burgers and yum. Really? Ah. Yum. So I started using those for my salads. Oh my God. So good. Oh, good. That's good. You like them. I never tried one. I, if you have not tried a turkey burger, like a homemade one, you really need to. They are so much more juicier than like a real burger, like a ground beef burger. They have flavor and it's crazy because I only put a couple, you know, things on it. I don't like put a whole bunch of seasoning. And it is so good. So good. No, I meant, I mean, I've had that before, but I haven't had the garden burger. Oh, I don't know. I, I tried one because there was a, there's a place here called, um, let me see how often I order from there. Um, oh my God, it's something burgers. It's something burgers. But they use really good meat and they have veggie burgers. So what I did was I actually ordered veggie burgers and didn't tell anybody. Everybody's like, oh my God, this burger is great. I'm like, right? So when they were down, I was like, that was a veggie burger. <laughs> and everybody could not believe it. It was so flavorful. Wow. It was really good. I, uh, uh, I was going to say something, now it's gone. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, Boomer. <laughs> shit. It's so, so good. I don't know. I'm just, it's like, I've noticed now that I haven't had like real ground beef or, you know, any type of beef, like I can taste the difference. Like for like burgers, when you out, it's mainly grease you're tasting. But even if you go to a burger place that has either turkey or veggie, you can taste the flavors. Yeah. It's so much better. That's what I was going to say. Turkey sausage is really, turkey really Turkey bacon I use. Turkey kibasi I use. Oh, my God. The turkey kibasi is freaking, or kibasa, however you want to say it. Oh, I bet that's great. It is amazing. Uh, you know, because it's got that skin on the outside. I don't yeah. know how they do it, but um, I use that for everything. I'll put it in rice. I'll put it in um salad i'll put i'll i'll put it everywhere it's yeah. spaghetti sauce i put it in every oh my god it's so we good put it in scrambled eggs last week we had breakfast for dinner 
Yeah, scrambled. I'll even mix it in scrambled eggs. I mean, it's just great. And I love turkey bacon. I do not like, re- I've never liked regular bacon oh my because God. I can literally taste the the grease of the bacon. Yes. I love the smell of it. But oh as soon as I go, it's all I, I don't taste anything but grease and burn. And so I've never liked bacon until I tried turkey bacon. Wow, you've had some pretty rotten bacon then. No, I mean, my whole family's love bacon, whether it's, you know, cooked crispy or not crisp, it doesn't matter. I just, that's the taste I get from them. It's like, a, you know how some people taste pepper in their flavors, you know, when yeah. it, it's like that. I taste, that's what I taste. And it's, oh, yeah. Um, but yeah, I love that. The turkey Italian sausage links are, to, I haven't tried the turkey Italian sausage links, but the kibasi, you are, however you say it, kibasi, whatever. You got to try it. It's really, really good. Really good. I'm telling you. I mean, it's making my mouth water. What's and sometimes I'll just make rice with fried eggs and I'll have a slice on the side of like mm. the kibasi sausage and the turkey kibasi. And it's so good. We always start talking food when it's towards the end. <laughs> I know, right? Well, that's because I'm so hungry. But anyway, before we go any further, let's go ahead. And um, once again, Brad's Vapor is sponsoring tonight's um, live stream. As usual, we're going to be doing a gerbil. Now, do not put nothing in chat yet. If you do, you're disqualified. Let me explain what it is. What it is is it's a gerbil. Some, it's a gerbil that Brad will be sending you. It's not going to be a furry creature, but it's going to be what we call a gerbil. Well, um, okay. What you're going to be doing is once I say start in the chat, only when I say start in the chat, you're going to go ahead and pick a number between the numbers range that I'm going to give you. And then the first one to get that number, the first one closest gets it. Now, if somebody has gotten your number, you can put another number, but you cannot keep putting numbers. So unless somebody got your number, you can't put another number. So how many people do we have in chat right now? We have 84 with 65 thumbs up. Oh, wait, 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 84 and 82. 65. All right, so whoever hasn't done the thumbs up, I'm going to give you a second so you can go ahead and do that and then we'll start. So just let me know when that number gets back up and it matches the people in chat and then we'll go ahead and start the gerbil. Here we go again. <laughs> because it's only fair that you're getting something that I get something because I'm the one here doing it. So thumbs up. Once you get matching, it's one in the morning and we only need one more person. I got to go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> and don't forget, if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button too. Just saying, just and saying. Thumbs follow, up, subscribe. Follow Wendy on Instagram because she needs her, her thing. I'm trying to get my swipey uppy on Instagram. So if you would not mind, please go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's Wendy Vapes. It's really, really easy. But yeah, so, just, but that's not part of the gerbil. But that's just because you love me. Look. <laughs> How can you not love that face? How okay, can you we- not? We've got. I, I mean, do you lives. know how much time I spend on my makeup just for these Monday live streams? No. <laughs> Eighty-four likes. All right. So we're matching. We're even well, up. We're. We've got eighty-six likes, and eighty-seven watching. Eighty-six watching. Okay. So now we're gonna, right. We got it. We got so it. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put the the message start in here, and we're gonna pick a number between one and one hundred. Go ahead and start. Now, this is U.S. only. Um, Brad's Vapor is in the U.S., so it is U.S. shipping only. But go ahead and pick a number between 1 and 100. Again, you can only pick a number one time unless your number has been picked. Then you can repick. So like Mandalorian, I mean, Al, wait. Yeah, Al, you can go ahead and pick another number because Mandalorian already picked that. Oh, wow. It's going, it's going, it's going, it's going. Come on. Frank oh, guys, yeah. paper, let's do this. Hi, Helena. Hi, Kim. Frank Miser's already Frank-a-mizer. 42 taken already. Yeah, uh, 42 is taken. Mowgli, how are you, sweetheart? Hey. I miss you. <laughs> I get to see everybody. That's oh, damn, that. Kim. <laughs> Kim came in one second too late with a 99. Oh, man. Mowgli, why'd you retract it? And make I sure you're with you. I didn't say take out your number. And make sure oh, you're live good. chat. Oh, okay. 
Make sure I'm you're like, on... wait, don't go anywhere. <laughs> Make sure I'm you're on my chat. Uh, yeah, just pick another number. If somebody picked your number, pick another number. There you go. Hi, Annie. Hi, Billy. All right, just keep going, keep going, keep going because we, I mean we have eighty six people. So hey, Helena, I know that it's gonna run a little long. Hey, Helena. And then we'll pick a number. <clears throat> Yay! <laughs> Mowgli's like, forget this shit. <laughs> I'll pick one. Oh, we don't have fresh to pick the number. What are we gonna? Oh, do I can do it. Okay. Or you can do it. Yeah. Look, you know how to do it. There you go. And it's Toonie's turn to tune it up. What? Oh. <laughs> what? It's okay, Mowgli. I got you. But that's a good number, I think. All right. So we're going to be cutting it down soon. Check your numbers. Make sure nobody has your number. Again, it is within the United States, and this is going to be sponsored by Brad's Vapor. Brad's Vapor, you can find anything that you need, whether it be coils, juice, um, kits, mouth along devices, whatever you want, he's got them. And you can use the coupon code WendyVapes10. It gets you 10% off of anything on the website, even special orders or whatever, 10% off, which is always for Wendy. And free shipping is oh yeah, free huge. shipping too. I mean, and it's fast shipping too. He does not play. I forget who it was. Oh, as a matter of fact, we were talking about um, Roger earlier. Roger went and made an order because he wanted the um, Ursa Quest, and he placed an order. And the same day, it, it got shipped out. Like so he already had shipping nice. information same day. So Brad's Vapor don't play. Okay, so I'm gonna count down from ten, and then we're gonna stop this. So it's ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, Mowgli, four, three, two, and one. Stop. Okay, so no more numbers, and you're going to go ahead and pick a number between one and 100. Get this. Seven. Seven. Number seven. Seven. Who's got seven? Let's see who's got seven. Let's go all the way up. Oops, too far up. Seven, 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 seven. Make sure you're not on top chat. Seven, seven, seven. Seven, seven, seven. Wow, okay. looks like Frankenmiser. I think that's it. Let me go back up on top again. Closest to seven. Closest Crazy, to nobody picked low numbers. Wow, if, if he wouldn't have picked it, Mowgli would have picked it. Bob, Bob was pretty low. <laughs> no, Bob was right there, too. Oh, shit. Well, we've got Fidalgo that was two away also. All right, so who was first? Let's see. All right, so... All right, hold on. I see nine. Uh, let me see. Five and nine. Because Frank and Miser picked 69 first. Nobody had already picked it. So that would have been his number. Because you can only pick it, another one if somebody took your number or somebody already had your number. So, oh, Vaping Paradox had, had his number. Oh. So then he went, no. No, Frank and Miser had it first. So that 69 was Frank and Miser's. Uh, let's see. So it's between Frankenmiser and Fidalgo. Fidalgo well, Frankenmiser picked, picked 69 first. Nobody else had 69. Oh, then Frankenmiser is ousted. Yeah, that's the thing because he was right after um, Billy Nolan at 75. Frankenmiser had 69, and I don't see another 69 before him. So he wouldn't have picked another number. I see Deb had 69, but where is she at? Deb was down. Oh, Vaping Paradox. Vaping Paradox had it, but it was after. Where's Deb's? I didn't see Deb. Oh, this is a squirrely one. Oh, yeah. Deb did have 69, so then his is in. This is so freaking hard. Hold <laughs> on. These numbers came so freaking close this time. Yeah. All right. So it'll be the first one closest. So what was our number? Seven? Yes. Yes. Okay. So four is three away. So the next one is nine, which is two away. 
right? Right. And then we have five that's, all right, so the first one to get closest is Fidalgo. Fidalgo! I mean, back me up. Everybody else check too, because we're, we're always fair here. So it's the first one to get it or the first one closest. So please, please, please. I'm trying to take out the extra numbers here. Yeah, it looks like Fidago to me with nine. Because that is two away from a seven. Okay, that's what I got. That's what I got. All right, does everybody agree on that one? Yeah. I agree. Where's my stop button? <laughs> I, because I'm trying to get back to the bottom. Is anything you're trying to do? Do I have 69 first? Okay, does everybody? <laughs> are you sure, Fidalgo? Well, the next one would be Frankenmeiser, right? Is Frankenmeiser the second one? I think so, because he, he got his 69 slashed out. Uh-huh. Yeah, because Deb had 69 already. So then he had a legitimate number number five. Okay. There we go. All right, you sure, Fidalgo? I need confirmation. He says, give it to Frankenmeister. Yeah, we're yeah. not doing we're not doing Bob Barker not going over rules. <laughs> Fidalgo said, uh, yes, I'm good with it. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. So awesome. Frank and Frank and Ma Frank and Meister, right? That's yeah. how you say it. Frank and Meister, you're gonna be the winner. Thank you so much, Fidalgo. Hey. I love you. Um, so go, what I need to do, someone told Frank to, yeah, that's a, yeah. So he was the second one to be the closest. So yay. Oh, now Frankenmeiser wants to fifth back to Fidalgo. <laughs> All right. Y'all need to figure this out. <laughs> I think it's figured out. Frankenmeiser goes home with the gerbil. Nice. Yeah, who's going home with the gerbil is all I want to know. <laughs> so whichever one of you decides, go ahead and send me an email at wendyvapes at yahoo.com. Yeah. Not anywhere else, yahoo.com. No, but somebody else had 42 also. There was a whole bunch of 42s, especially at the beginning. Yeah, he, his number got canceled out a bunch. And then he yeah, probably- Yeah, from Mandalorian had 42 in. first. So his got canceled, then he picked the next one. So no, he was right. He had it, he, he did it right. He did. It's just that everybody picked the same freaking numbers. <laughs> this is the first time that we had so many overpicks. That was fun. Yeah, that was a tough one. That was fun though. It made it even more interesting. Okay, so me either. Who's me either what? Um, okay, so Frankenmeiser has a tongue out. And Frankenmeiser says me either. I know, this was crazy. Tonight's was literally crazy. Very yeah, funny. There was like four people to pick 42. Yeah. Me too, BSO. Well, we don't know who the winner is. So is it Frankenmeiser or is it Fidalgo? Either one of you, go ahead and message me. And then I'll go ahead and get that information over to, um, over to, um, Brad. what's his name? Brad. Brad. <laughs> and then if, if you can both just message her and whoever email gets there first, then. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Timestamp. Whoever's email reaches me first, you're the winner. <laughs> Hi, Becca. Thank you so much, Jackson. Oh, uh, I think this will adopt the gerbil. Oh, uh, that's sure so cool. you will. Yeah, that was fun. Look at how many numbers were duplicated. This is the first time it ever got like that. I've never seen it like that. There's maybe like three times that people have to do it, but this was like one person, four different numbers. That's crazy. That's why I always slam mine in at the very top so that I, I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> It's like I hear I the word go. Look for trying the to do that because they went fast. That was so crazy. It's the chances you take. Yeah, you got to email me because I don't save all the information. So if you won before, seriously, I have too much stuff that I may never get to anyway. All right, so all right, so we've got Frankenmeister, my Frankenmeister. Oh my gosh. Franken, I'm very, 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 very excited. Zero. Zero. 
Pharaoh's messaging me that he's listening. <laughs> oh. He says, congratulations. <laughs> so, oh, wendyvapes at yahoo.com. Sorry about that. I thought you meant, do I have to email you again? And I'm like, yeah, I don't keep no information. So just wendyvapes <laughs> at yahoo.com. I try to make it easy. <clears throat> so I'm trying that strawberry shirt. Good night, Frankie. Have a good evening. Night, Frank. Good Thank thing. you so much for that. That drip witch thing? Yes. That Did we made it? Couple, we made it a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. It, it's all I can taste is the sugar cone. Really? Because all I tasted was strawberry. That's why I made it made it over again. But you're supposed to have the cone and then the strawberry and ice cream. Yeah. But you changed not, the strawberry. You didn't use the same one, did you? No, I used all the same things as you uh, on the first go round. Well, I, I only made it one time on our live, and then I made it on my own. Yeah, the one. This is the one from the live. Yeah, that one should be more too much strawberry. You have a good night, too, Frankie. Am I going strawberry? Good night, Kathy. Night? Thank you, Advocate for Liberty. So, no, yes, what you only? I love the flavor of the cone. Just drink in the cone. It is Feel good. the cone. And the ice cream made it very smooth and right? nice. Right? But you need to try my other recipe. The final recipe, you need I, to try that one. I don't uh, have thank that, you, Michelle. I don't have that condensed milk yet. Yes, yet. you did. You had gotten it. No, I had I, another recipe that we needed it for. I've never gotten the condensed milk. Are you sure? Because I remember you getting it. I think it was at the same time that you got the brie. It was like around that time because we were trying stuff that you didn't want to try. Let me double check. I really think you did. Thank you, Robin. We're going to see her and fight over condensed milk for a minute. <laughs> Elemento. It starts with a C. Um, the only condensed milk I have, I do have a condensed milk, but I got it eons ago. It's from uh, Real Flavors. Oh, maybe that's why you didn't get it because you had one. But which I don't know. You, mine is a flavor art. Have? Flavor art? Yeah. Okay, I'll remember that and put that on my next. But oh. just check the notes for both of them, the real flavors and the flavor art and see what the notes say on them. Because if they're similar, then you could probably use it. That's true. Start I'll check low. It out. Yeah, because I know I'm going to be putting in a pretty huge uh, Wonder Flavors. Uh, that's what I said, Swaggy. Even Swaggy's like, I think she does have condensed milk. <laughs> I'm telling you, I really... <laughs> All right, thank you so much, Cloud Checker. Don't forget to check me out on my Facebook group. And everybody, thank you so much for being here. We do appreciate it. I appreciate you every single day. Thank you for making my week because these live streams do... They, they just, they really boost me up and they give me strength to go on for the rest of the week. I really do appreciate it. Frankie Miser, I'll go ahead and check that out. Thank you so much. And I love each and every one of you. Everybody have a really, really nice, what is the highest percent has used in the condensed milk? I don't know, but I, the one of my recipe is really, really good. It's perfect. <laughs> but thank you. So, aw, that's awesome, Frankie Miser. But I love each and every one of you. Everybody have a great evening and love one another. And don't forget, fill out the vape surveys especially the one for the mail and the post office and everything that Michelle has been sharing and that I shared in the groups. Make sure that you're filling those out because we need to have our voices heard. And it's not just five voices that make the noise. It's all our voices that make the noise. So don't forget to fill those out. Keep on vaping. And if you are ever having a problem or something, reach out to one of us. Um, somebody will always have enough time. If I don't have time, Addie will have time. If Addie doesn't, Demilla and I'll have time. We're all here for you guys. So please just reach out to us. Also, Michelle, um, her as well. So yeah, so everybody have a great week. I love you guys. Good night. <laughs>